but at the same time sad. No one cares what she has to say. I'm just saying. If you want to wa see what she says, just pause the video. I I don't care what she says. Who's who's fiance? It's not. I must refuse. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. Shut up, Sarah. I hate you. I dislike you. I'm afraid I cannot see you well. I will call someone to escort you. That will not happen, and I hope we do not have to see each other ever again. I'll tell father about what happened today. E ever again? Break up. How strange of you to say that when we never been together. If you thought that exchanging a few words was being together, then you are delusional. In addition, that photo of the cat can easily be found online. You must be very confident in my father's support to shamelessly walk into my house with such a photo. Will you please leave? I do not wish to further waste my time, as I must find my cat. I will tell father that you brought a fake photo of my cat to win over my affections. If my father has any sis left in him at all, he'll stop talking about the marriage. Mm. Sarah, I'm you and friend, please watch what you say. I forgot to clean the plates this morning. I should have called a maid. Shut up, bitch. Yo, 
you're hurting my ears. Seriously, why did you, my father bring in this woman? I wanted to end this quickly since Britta is watching, but this reminds me of an episode in the soap opera. Haha, <laughs> you watch soap operas, I mean what? I mean, it's okay to watch those. This has just become unnecessarily troublesome, but I'll do it for my father. Your fake tears. Your timid te threats. It's all so cliche that I can't help but laugh. I can guarantee you that your threats are pointless to me. I've gone through this multiple times in the past. You should just use your energy on something else in life. Giving you advice will only be a waste of time, so let's stop it at that. Not yet. I do not get angry very often. But you've annoyed me enough to make me talk. I know very well from experience that people like you will do whatever it takes to get what you want. You will have the right skills and even the spontaneity sp it takes to do it. But people like you easily fall into nihilism once you've acquired that wealth you so conveyed. I can't pronounce things. I felt pity. A life filled with pointlessness. But I suppose that's the life you want. I had all the wealth ever since I was born. Do you want some? A couple million? Is that what you want? Tell me, if you ask me for it, I might give it to you. You need money, right? It's nothing to me. Jimin, I think you're too emotional right now. Are you okay? I'm fine, Britta. He's just acting. I do not like talking about impossible things. I just repeated some lines from a soap opera I watched. It's funny that you're almost replaying that scene for me. Apparently it's a very popular TV show these days. Yes. Unfortunately I'll be charged with embezzlement if I use company assets, as assets for personal means. I'm not keen on being behind iron bars. Yes, you managed to come here with a fake photo of my cat you found online and insult my dear Britta. My joke is only fair, don't you think? Britta's not an average girl. What you see isn't everything. You won't understand if, even if I explain it to you. It seems we have no more to talk about. Why don't you leave? I don't know what it is not fair, but if you do not wish to leave, I will use you to do what I want. There was something I wanted to do, but I just couldn't come up with a proper excuse. But this seemed to happen often in soap operas. Britta, I'm sorry. It seems you'll have to excuse me. I had no other choice to let her out. Yes, let's put it at that. And I was going to do it soon anyways. Bask in the glory of a kiss! Everyone, bask in its glory! Bask in it! Bask in the glory! Nick. Nick. Just human. Shh. You're blushing. You'd better close your eyes. Focus on your senses. Go ahead, bitch. What? 
Yes, having an audience for our first kiss takes off the tension. Your lips are so warm and soft. And I think I saw a bit of the pancake. You're cute, Britta. <laughs> God, finally she's leaving. Juman, can we really do this? To be honest, I wanted to kiss you from the first moment I saw you. I'm sorry if that was so sudden. I wanted you to be comfortable here. Perhaps I bothered you. But I don't regret what I did. Is this appropriate when Elizabeth is missing? This has nothing to do with that. It's my emotions. And Elizabeth isn't here, but you are. Oh, I just realized something after the kiss. That you are indeed different from Elizabeth III. The special person who can truly understand me. Who I can touch and kiss and understand what I'm saying. I've known this for a while now. That I need someone like you, not a cat. And seeing you right in front of my eyes, I feel like I've finally gotten to know what I wanted. I don't want to be a fool who loses what he needs. Elizabeth III, even if I find her again, she's just a cat. But you're different. You can soak in all of my emotions. You can be mine. That makes me happy. Jimin, first calm down. You are worried about Elizabeth a minute ago. A cat. I've never been so sure of my feelings. Now Elizabeth III isn't here, it must be ironic that I'm so happy. Cat, quit it. But I've realized what I truly wanted thanks to my cat going missing. Oh, Eric, oh my god, cat. I want you, and I want you to want me too. God, I'm gonna kill this cat! I mean this. I think my rela any relationship needs time. Let's think about it. First, let's find Elizabeth. I can understand it if you need time, cat. Just don't leave my side right now. I try to be the man who can do anything for you. That's... That's what everyone expected from me ever since I was little. Britta, I won't say much, even if it takes time. I want to have everything you are. That cat is making so much noise. So just stay here with me. Throat hurts, doing Juman's voice.